What is up my fellow mobile gamers? In today's video, we have our Tales Noir partner tier list. Subscribe to the channel, thumbs up this video. It is greatly appreciated, my friends. Uh, first thing I just want to do uh, mention is the fact that I have to unfortunately uh, record from my tablet and then move the, the content over here. I can't sign into my main account on computer because uh, this is what happens every time I try and link my account on my tablet everything is cut off at the bottom you see that like the quick login is completely cut off on my tablet uh i can't sign in with google i can't sign in with facebook uh it's pretty annoying so i always have to like do this recording and do it like this way and then if we go into the game you'll see as i'm trying to like bind my account it's all just cut off at the bottom. I can't even like hit the enter button. But today's video sponsor is App Gallery. They have some amazing coupon codes going on right now. And they have that Huawei device giveaway. I'm going to show you how to download App Gallery and talk about these amazing offers that are currently going on. We're going to go to the website. We are going to click download and install App Gallery. Then for selecting a country, make sure you put Italy no matter where you live. We're going to sign up using an email address we're going to create one then we are going to do verification with our phone number and then we are in there it is all of your favorite apps your mobile games the best part about it is the rewards and the gifts rewards are when you spend money in the game you'll get a kickback and then gifts we have gifts for all of these different mobile games which are exclusive that you can only find on app gallery currently app gallery has some pack offers going on currently the first one you can get for completely free, all you have to do is download the game through App Gallery. The second offer is a newbie pack. All you have to do is recharge any amount to claim these additional rewards right here. And the third offer is to recharge a specified amount in total to claim the corresponding packs. So when you spend five, 10, 20, 50, or 100 euro, you can claim different levels of gift codes. Note that if you spend 10 euro, you can claim the five and 10 euro code. And if you spend 20 euro, you can claim the five, 10 and 20 euro code. And finally, App Gallery is having their device giveaway for users who have a shipment address in the European Union region. All you have to do is spend a certain amount of money in Tails Noir through App Gallery and you will have a chance at one of these amazing devices for free. Make sure you go ahead and join the Discord now and contact an admin for more details taking a look at our first partner for our tier list i'm not going to go over every single partner because this video would take forever so i'm just kind of picking out certain partners that i want to mention that are really good some that are okay uh, first up we have this is s tier list so if you can get her definitely 100 a must use this is the legendary mermaid princess definitely i would say one of the best partner healers in this game uh, does a bunch of damage and heals allies for a percentage she also has two passive abilities so a lot of characters have like active abilities and then like these awakened abilities the awakened abilities are the ones that kind of show up on the screen uh, right above your skill list. You'll see like the three different skills. Those are the awakened skills. Um, then you have stuff like the active skills that is just automatically done by the partner. And then the passive skills are just passive. You know, they, they're always there. So she has two really good passive abilities. This first one we have allies that pass through her waves have movement speed increase by a percentage for an amount of time. And the other passive ability lets her slow enemies by 45% for three seconds. Next up for our S tier, we have another amazing healer, Legendary Castle Beauty. Does a ridiculous amount of healing, has one awakening skill, an active skill, and a passive skill. Partners passive skill allies within the range of Rose Garden have all their defense increased by 10%. So really good support. You're getting healing, you're getting defense. I mean, you're getting a bunch of different things with her. All right, next up we have an epic. We have the Playboy Prince himself. 
I would put him in like the A category. So we're, we have like S tier, A tier, B tier. Those are like the three that we're gonna focus on. I would put him in like the A tier. Um, not overpowered, but definitely a pretty strong epic uh, partner. And he is a damage dealing partner. His awakening abilities, which I, I really love, is the fact that he does a bunch of damage to nearby enemies. But this is the thing that I like reduces their crit rate by a percentage for five seconds upon leaving the field he does more damage moving on for our a tier list we have legendary partner sleeping beauty one awakened skill with two passives her awakening skill is ridiculously strong she projects a teddy bear from the land of dreams deals a ton of damage first damage inflicts doze off for eight seconds which causes a slowing effect over time starting from five percent all the way up to 70 percent so this is an insane slow ability really good for pvp content to slow the opponent down all right next partner we have is prince charming you actually get this partner for logging in each day i believe it's the third day uh i think it's your third login day that you get the legendary prince charming partner very good tank awakening skill does a bunch of damage and then while awakened prince charming absorbs the five percent of the player's damage taken so that's really good for anyone who's like uh for like the wizard class the archer class because you're very weak and you don't have a lot of high health or high defense so just having him out there as one of your partners to absorb a lot of that damage really really helps our next a tier list partner we have is a legendary partner little red riding hood has the damage partner icon but actually has some healing built into it so you'll see if we take a look at the awakened skill pulls in enemies deals a bunch of damage at the end she casts whirlwind which deals damage to the surrounding area and then 50 percent of the damage dealt while awakened is returned to the player as hp all right now let's take a look at some b tier list partners we have a legendary little glass slipper now you could put her in the a category um, because she does have a really good awakening skill that silences the enemies so like something like this is really really strong for pvp content um, but this tier list is kind of like uh, overall so it's we're looking at partners who are good for pve and partners who are good for pvp but i really like the silence in her awakening skill uh, so like i said you could definitely put her in the a tier list just strictly because of that um, she does also have two active abilities as well for our next b category we got a legendary partner snow white deals a bunch of damage to the area ahead eating grants a 50 percent chance to gain satisfaction which increases her damage by a percentage uh satisfaction effects from eating increases damage by an extra 10 percent and then the partner skill just does a bunch of damage to a single target so really good for taking down boss battles um i would probably say uh strictly for boss battles she's one of the stronger partners i like for boss battle strictly i would put her in like the a category possibly the s tier category because she has really good single target damage and then our next b tier list we have is another legendary partner we got match girl magic damage to the target area that at the end of the awakening cast red ballet blinking to the target and dealing some more magic attack and then the passive skill i really like pulls in enemies within 3.5 meters of the target red ballet deals 2.5 percent increased damage so i really like the uh pulling the pulling is really good for characters like the wizard when you do a lot of aoe damage stuff like that just brings everyone in a, a good group gathering very good for pve content let's take a look at some other partners we have an epic desert prince so this is aladdin you get aladdin for pre-registering i would put aladdin at like the a category uh i think aladdin is a very very strong partner a uh, really decent tank i really love the awakening skill does a bunch of damage so a rectangular area ahead and then it reduces their pen rate for five seconds this is a really strong awakening skill for pvp content just reducing your opponent's penetration which is really really important in pvp i mean it basically is what kind of counteracts the opponent's defense hope you guys and girls enjoyed the video stay happy stay safe my friends i'll see y'all later peace